The Deschutes Soil and Water Conservation District hosted an open house, inviting the Deschutes County residents out to learn more about conservation efforts. Any landowner, both rural or urban, has a lot of different needs, and if you give us a call, we can come out to your property, we could discuss what's going on, resource concerns, whether it's water conservation, forest health, pollinators, native vegetation, and we can provide assistance of how to move forward with that. We could provide management plans, and hopefully we could provide some funding to assist and implement those projects. The district also provided information about Measure 9176. It's on the November 5th ballot, and asked voters to approve a permanent tax rate of six cents per thousand dollars of assessed property value. Board member James Warren tells us why this measure is so important. We need to get more projects on the ground. Uh, we're very limited with the projects that we can do right now. And, and like we said earlier, our grants come from as far away as Washington, D.C., and we have to do what they tell us to do with that money. Board member Jeff Rollet says if Measure 9176 doesn't pass, just being funded through grants limits their ability on how they use funds. A lot of times we have money for water when sometimes our priority is for weeds. We have money for wildfire reduction when sometimes we need soils, soils amendments. So there's, there's a number of different resource concerns that we cannot address because of the restrictions on the funds that we have right now through grants. Guests at the open house believe every Oregonian should know or be involved in soil and water conservation. Soil and water is the lifeblood of all living things on this earth. Water is you know, just as important as soil. I could talk for hours about soil, but water is our lifeblood of plant diversity, wildlife, and humans. Without water, we cannot survive. The district says they don't enforce or create regulations. Instead, they focus on more voluntary efforts. Tracy Tuesday, News Channel 21.